you all right? It's okay. It's good. Wait a minute. Can I look at this? You're not a doctor. No. No, but I've sprained a lot of sprained a lot of ankles. Most of mine. We should uh we should ice this. We should also report that guy. Was your boyfriend? That was for money. Oh. Aren't you going to finish? I'm oh, sorry. You think that's it's got nothing to do with me? Tight? No. I work in a travel agency. I wanted to feel like all those people with first class tickets and pretty clothes. I guess I wanted to feel rich. How much would it take to feel rich? I don't know. How much would it take to feel safe? You did that. You made me feel safe. Most likely, everyone recognizes Tom Cruise in this scene from 1993's The Firm, a movie based on John Grisham's 1991 bestseller of the same name. 
but I'm not so sure how many people recognize Tom's temptress in this scene. So let me help you out. I was attending the New York Film Academy when the firm came out. A lot of hype surrounding it. So I bought the book, read it, loved it, went to see the movie, loved it. Now this temptress is only in that one scene, just five minutes and 30 seconds on the screen. But I fell in love with her right off the bat. Just her fourth credit of 29. She's way down the list. She's listed as Young Woman on Beach. And I've only seen her in one other movie, 1994's Legends of the Fall, with Brad Pitt and Anthony Hopkins. But I watched both movies dozens of times. Really like her. And she's quite interesting in real life. Wikipedia says Karina Lombard is a French-American actress. Interesting. She was born in Tahiti, which is French. But it says her mother's a Lakota Sioux Indian, which is American. And her father's Swiss, Russian, and Italian. She lived in Spain as a child, so that's her first language. Educated in Switzerland, sharp as a tack, and fluent in Spanish, English, French, and German. She moved to New York City at 18 and started modeling, got gigs with Elle and Vogue and Calvin Klein before becoming an actress. Prior to the firm, she landed a major role in 1993's Wide Sargasso Sea. Then the minor but important role in the firm that same year. A fine supporting role in Legends of the Fall in 1994. A decent role with Bruce Willis in Last Man Standing in 1996. And a starring role in Cole the Conqueror 1997. By the way, she did all her own stunts in Cole. She moved to TV and landed main roles in 17 episodes of The 4400. That was in 2005-2006. And 16 episodes of The L Word from 2004 to 2009. One episode each in CSI NY and NCIS. She has her own channel on YouTube, and I just found her on Twitter. Her birthday was two days ago. So I wished her a happy belated birthday. Just enough time left to squeeze in a plug for my outlaw biker saga, Born to be Wild, still selling 30 years after its first publication. A word of warning to the wise. Get your copy while the supply lasts. And thanks for stopping in today. Until next time. Mm -hmm. See you. And that's a wrap.